Okay, so um, this is the z-axis uh, from uh, you know from behind, uh, and I just wanted to show you quickly the the wear uh, over here. And uh, actually, it's pretty good. The worst uh, is the tersite here, which has started to delaminate, and as you can see, it's getting pretty thin. Uh, so my guess is uh, that the Gibbs might have been a bit too tight, I don't know, because this is very good, still thick and well uh, laminated. Same thing uh, on the bottom. Uh, on the camera it looks pretty bad, but to the touch it's uh, very good. So I'm guessing uh, this can you know, last uh, quite a long time. Still, uh, this would need to be replaced eventually, but uh, I'm not going to uh, replace it just yet. Uh, since I'm, you know, uh, redoing all of the electronics and everything, I want to put it all back together as it is, if I can, uh, unless it's real, real bad. Uh, test everything, and once everything is working. Uh, I'll you know probably take it all apart again and replace the stuff that really needs be re needs to be replaced and I guess this uh, would be a part of it. Uh, okay, so uh, underneath the uh, same deal, um, this here is uh, where the Gibbs um, are. As you can see, uh, this uh, surface is taper on both sides. And uh, so the Gibbs are here and they adjust like this. Uh, the Gibbs are very nice, very good, uh, very little wear. Um, they're just like new pretty much. Uh, same uh, for the other one, so uh, I'm quite pleased about that. And this surface here is uh, quite nice to the touch. So. I guess that's it. This in, in the middle here, these uh, surfaces are don't really matter. This is where the lead screw uh, is, and none of these uh, surfaces are touching anything, so uh, they don't really matter. But this, you know, it's all good. While looking at these images, uh, I noticed something, and I'd like to talk about it. So I'll pause the image here. And I'd like you to notice uh, how on the third side uh, in the center here uh, and on the extremities um, there is a difference and that can't be a coincidence and I think this is on purpose when they install the third side uh, they probably uh, uh, do it so that um, the middle uh, is um, recessed a bit so that the contact area is on both ends uh, which would make to make uh, total total sense so um, what I'm thinking is uh, that this could be an ind uh, indication if you uh, see that your third site is uh, worn um, to a point where you can't distinguish the you know the, the the recessed part in the middle that could be an indication that it's time to uh, to uh, replace your uh, tersite so um, well let me know in the comments if uh, you think this uh, makes sense okay so uh, again thank you for watching the video till the end and uh, see you on the next video bye